Are you getting the login failed error when launching Roblox Studio on your computer? Fret not! In this video, I'll show you how you can fix this error on your computer. So without wasting any time, let's get started. Solution 1. First reset your network configuration settings. To do this, first click on the search icon here and just type in CMD. Next right click on command prompt, select run as administrator and then click on yes. Now here, type net sh winsock reset and hit enter. This will reset the winsock catalog. Now type ipconfig forward slash flush dns and hit enter. This will delete the old dns server cache from your computer. Next type in net sh int ip reset and hit enter. And this will reset your ip protocol stack. Don't worry, I'll leave these commands in the video description below. Lastly, reboot your computer and check if the error is gone. Solution 2 If Roblox Studio is still not launching, try opening it with admin privileges. To do this, right-click on Roblox Player from the desktop and select Run as Administrator. Then click on Yes to give permission. Now check if it opens up without the error. Solution 3 If that doesn't help either, uninstall Roblox Studio and then reinstall it. To uninstall Roblox Studio, open up Settings. Next, click on Apps and then on Installed Apps. Now scroll down and find Roblox Studio. Next, click on the three-dot button next to it and select Uninstall. Then click on Uninstall again and Roblox will be uninstalled from your computer. Now go to create.roblox.com with the browser of your choice. Then from this page, click on Start Creating. Now when the pop-up appears, just click on Cancel and then click on Download Studio to start downloading it. Now if you're using Chrome, you have to click here and select Download Unverified File. Next, open the Roblox Studio Installer.exe and it should start installing Roblox Studio. Once it's finished, Roblox Studio should open by itself without showing that error. So that's how you fix the login failed error in Roblox Studio on your computer. If the video was useful to you, please hit the like button. And if you still have any questions, feel free to leave them below and I'll get back to you soon. Thanks for watching.